smoky, smoky. I detect bacon fat laced with honey milk. I just read an article. California is going to produce wine that will rival the finest of the French. I'm going to California to try and find some respectable competition. In honor of your bicentennial, I'm organizing a tasting. What do you want? To taste your Chardonnay. Hey, can we get a barrel sample for this uh, French wine snob? Believe it! Make out! Plenty of palatable wines around here. You don't have to worry about that. My definition of palatable might be slightly different from yours. You're a snob. Am I? Hey, Bo. Hey, Joe. You didn't call. Having trouble with that big old dialing finger again. Which one were you with today? <laughs> Raised in the vineyards of Northern California, he has our valley's grapes in his blood. Taste that wine. Tell me if you still would have rather sold your grapes to Gallo. Can I try it? Did you sleep with her? She liked my wine. A lot. Why don't I like you? Because you think I'm an arsehole. And I'm not really. I'm just British and, well, you're not. I've read about it, but I've never seen it. You can make a wine too perfectly. You have to have it in your blood. You have to blow up with the soil underneath your nails. And the smell of the grape in the air that you breathe. Just want to not fail at this. To not completely fail. I wanted you to have two bottles of our Chardonnay, if you decide to choose them. My family runs a small vineyard here in Napa. I'm only allowed to carry on one bottle of wine. My granddaddy made hooch during Prohibition. Yeah! Ha! Baby! Oh my God! Taste This is the best Chardonnay I've ever tasted. Wine is sunlight held together by water. The poetic wisdom of the Italian physicist, philosopher, and stargazer Galileo Galilei. I am technically not French.